Hey Moonbeams, this is Donna Moon Goddess. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you'll, oh my God. Also hit the notification bell. Also hit the notification bell so you'll know when I upload new content about our girl, the big, fabulous, beautiful moon. All right, let's get started. <laughs> All right, it's a new moon today. Also earlier we had an eclipse. Um, I live in North America, but I know it wasn't visible from where I am. So hopefully you were lucky and you got a chance to see it live and in person. Um, I did watch some on a video, which was pretty nice, but you know, one day again, I hope to get to see it because I think I saw one some years ago. I don't remember when it was because I was a little younger. But anyway, all right. So it's the last new moon of 2020. Next time we get a new moon, we're going to have a new year. Awesome. I know a lot of y'all are very excited about that. I actually had a pretty good year. It wasn't bad. Got some things done. Got a new name. It's all good. Okay, since it was a new moon eclipse, it's a extra special and extra powerful time. So, <laughs> the eclipse just means that the earth, the moon and the sun are all in a particular alignment. So the moon is in between the earth and the sun. So the moon blocks out the sun from our view because it's directly in the middle there. So new moons are always powerful times to make wishes and work on things you'd like to manifest. So since this one was an eclipse as well as a new moon, it's extra powerful and the energy is expansive. So you will definitely want to make sure you get everything in order Actually, it's a good time to do that. Even though it's a new moon now, the new moon is void of course. So you don't want to actually start anything new at the time the moon is void of course. So about 12 hours after the new moon, for me it was 11.16 this morning, new moon. So I think it's 10.55 this evening that it'll go into the next sign. So then after that, you know, you can wish away manifest your little heart out but you want to wait during the void of course because the moon doesn't give that's what I hear during the void of course when she's basically moving from one time one sign to another most simple way to put it so during the time of the void of course and actually any time before you make your wishes you want to really center yourself and get your thoughts together Make sure you are calm and clear and relaxed. Because when it's time to actually make your wishes, you wanna be able to pull in all the energy that you need so you can put it right back out. So what do you wanna manifest for the month? What do you wanna manifest for the coming year? Keep those things in mind. And it's nothing wrong with getting it all together in your head while the moon is void, of course, but, you know, just don't actually do your thing until later. Definitely um, go within, really, really be clear, really clear on what you want to manifest. And a good way to do that is by meditation. I'm sure you hear it from everybody. But for me, um, I like to use a, I'm sure you hear that from everybody. Okay, again. But for me, I like to use a candle flame, like this exact one, actually. So I like to stare at that because I'm not very good at uh, closing my eyes and meditating. I often fall asleep, especially if I'm reclined or like, I don't know. Yeah, we'll just stick with that. <laughs> so it's just, I, I fall asleep very easily. One other thing you could do is just kind of softly gaze at something, kind of like barely have your eyes open. That helps, but 
the candle flame for me is great. Sometimes guided meditations are also very good. Um, what do you like to do? Tell me down in the comments. When you make your wishes, make sure to get really, really emotional about it. Feel the feeling of the wish fulfilled. Those are not my words. I cannot remember who exactly said it. I'm sure many of you know. But that is so important. I mean, I'm, I'm sure we could all get better at that. I know I can get better at that. But I've seen times when I've actually done it. And it was amazing. It works. Okay, moonbeams. I just wanted to do a little quick video today. So get your wish list together. And make your month and your next year coming up this 2021 fantastic all right i'll see you for the next moon phase which is going to be the waxing crescent and take care moonbeams and high vibes all right let's get manifesting so i would like to pull a card for y'all see what we get this is a group card and i'm thinking about you every one of you thinking about you right now got you got you okay all right will one jump out or will i pick one from the top let's see i like when they jump all right Ooh. okay that was too many we're gonna start that again I did say like when they jump and they're like, wee, oh, did he? <laughs> right when I said it. Okay. This is getting a little crazy now. All right. Now I'm just throwing them. Y'all aren't going to listen to anything I say. I'm like this chick, I don't know what she's talking about. She's just screwing around. <laughs> All right. Seriously though. All right. I'm ready. Oh, I had it. This one. Oh, wait, where's the camera? Okay. Don't let your past hold you back. That's right. Don't do it. 